to part 101 of the Male Hunter Baby Challenge, Season 2. In this episode, Stan gets a new girlfriend. Um, then Joseph and Kai age up. And Stan goes to GeekCon. So that's good. Uh, this new girlfriend here. Um, you know, I had her name. I don't, I don't want to just not say girlfriend. Um... Briley Eckert. Briley Eckert. I think, yeah. She's girlfriend number eight. So that's good, I guess. And we're starting in an, the next g- girlfriends from 9 to 13 are the Mermaid Likes, Mermaid Likes crew. So. Or any of the female X crew from 9 to 13. I ain't gonna tell you in what order. <laughs> you'll, you'll see eventually. Anyway, <laughs> I just saw something very interesting. Very interesting. Okay, something came up on my YouTube recommendations. Is, uh,. Someone working on a furry mod for Sims 4, you know, and create a Sim. And let me tell you, <laughs> I have some ideas. I don't know if it's out yet. I just got, there's like three parts to it that I know of. And this is looking at the second part. I'm like, I got some ideas. <laughs> ah. Oh, man. This is going to be cool. If I ever get my hands on it, I'm going to I'm going to review on it. I'm not kidding. It'd be like a cast video review. I'm not kidding, man. I I, I can't wait to get my hands on the, this mod. I want to try it out. I'm sure it's not free. <laughs> Look how much work this person is putting into it, though. Um, I can't remember the YouTuber. I was just watching it. My gosh. But, you know what I'm talking about if you've seen it. So I'm making a furry mod. That'd be cool, though. Have <laughs> Lex crew as furries. You can do cats and dogs now. And <laughs> that's going to be cool. I don't know. I just saw. I just only saw the video. I'm, I'm sure if there's a mod, the mod out. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't know. I mean, it'd be interesting. And why is the dollhouse broken again? That needs to end right now. Someone needs to stop breaking that dollhouse. It's driving me nuts. I don't know why I keep putting them in the house. They're going to get destroyed constantly. I, I don't know why I do it. Just do it, I guess. I don't know. For good for aesthetic. That's why I put them there. Just fill up some empty space in the room. That's why I do it. The fairy house. I'm rethinking the fairy house. I saw somebody make a pixie house. And I'm like. Huh. I'm, I'm totally rethinking my fairy enchanted legs. It's... I don't know, man. I don't know about it. It's just... I don't know. It's putting on... Let's put it this way. It's still in the works. It's still in the works. I don't know if the fairy house should be more brown. Or more pink and purple. I don't know. I got so many brown legs houses, it's not funny. Maybe I should go for pink and purple. I don't know, but I uh, but I have some similar color Valentine legs. I'm a little stuck on it. Okay, I'm stuck on it. Okay, um, the reason I was cho- choosing these black, brown, dark brown and light brown colors for my fairy house was because... Most of the custom content furniture are around that color. So, I was just matching the custom content. (laughs) 
So here we are at GeekCon, getting out of the house, which is good. Just getting out of the house. When's the last time you saw Stan get out of the house? Be honest with me. When's the last time you seen him get out of the house? Hardly ever. Not, what, episode about 96, probably. And here it is, episode 101. He's finally getting out of the house. Which is good. Maybe he's waiting for the person to get back with the rocket so he can go, go to space or something. Anyways, not much else to talk about. Also, I, for the fairy house, for my fairy enchantment place, I want to create a whimsical looking staircase. I don't know how to do that without making it look stupid. I got some fairy doors and some fairy windows as custom content. Um. I don't know if it actually works. I haven't tested it, the, the the fairy doors because they're round. <laughs> I've not tested the fairy doors if the Sims can walk through them or not. I have not. I think I'll put. I'll. I think I should test it before I make the build, so it's not completely useless. Because I remember when I built a, a retail store called uh, Twisty's Whirly Gigs. It's just Twisty the Clown. He's got his own retail store full of toys and, and he sells toys. You know? And um, and, I, and I downloaded all this clown stuff. One was like a clown door. But it didn't work. So I'm worried about this door to, this fairy door. I don't know if it's going to work or not. There's a couple different ones. One with the ivory, on, ivory design on it and one that isn't. One is plain. I don't know. I wish there was more fairy stuff. I should really look it up. Because I can't download anything from Sins Fileshare. I mean, Sins Fileshare and my computer don't agree with each other. And Sins Resource don't have a lot I can work with. Oh, they got a ton of outfits. Though. Tons of good outfits. First and resource but I need anything I can use for builds okay I need to build a house I mean stuff you see in a fairy house you got something like something you'll see with the magic real magic pack with custom content I'm, I'm working on I don't know what color stairs should be. I don't know. I don't know how to make it whimsical. I I don't know. <laughs> oh, I suck at this. I really suck at this. I was going to build a three-story legs and guess what? It didn't look too well because at that time I didn't have the custom stairs. Now that there's custom stairs I think it'll look pretty well. But now, I'm still not going to try that. Building three story likes again. I'm not doing that again. Forget it. It's going to look stupid. Wait, it did look stupid. Not going to tempt it again. You know, when I built the mermaid likes, it was not what I had in mind. I built it kind of wrong. What I wanted to go for was a waterfall inside the legs. The wall, the water cascading, cascading down the walls. But then where would you put your stuff? <laughs> and, uh, oh, some of the walls, you have, you know, have water. Because you got those fountains where it looks like the, from spa day, that it looks like water's cascading down. I like to put, I was going to put those in the legs. The mermaid legs, but I didn't do it. I don't know why. I forgot all about it. But it, it probably would have been cool. I don't know. We all think. 
Anyways, we have a party here. Where Joseph and Kai age up teenagers. Don't worry, I'll fix them. I'm going to make Kai look like Kai. But he's an alien. This Kai is an alien. We got a mermaid, we got a mermaid Kai here. And we're going to have an alien Kai. Kind of make up for the fact that I could have done four generations of Kai. But I didn't. I chickened out. I'm not going to chicken out four generations of Prince. I know. I'm just deciding. I only decided on one house he was going to live in. The Volcano Legs. Should he also live in the second magical lex? I mean, I don't know. I'm not going to have him live in the gingerbread lex. Prince is not... You don't would see Prince in a gingerbread lex. No. Well, the other two have the castle. Like, don't make him live in the castle, Lex. And it's going to be located in when he's a vampire, and vampire prince is going to live in the medieval castle, Lex. Um, I know that much. It's going to be kind of old school because in medieval times you don't have a lot of electronics. There's not going to be a TV. There's not going to be computers. It's going to suck, but, you know, it's a challenge. <laughs> it's not off the grid or anything, but you can use it off the grid. Maybe, I don't know. It's, I have some custom content in there. You'll see the build eventually. <laughs> I don't get it. She's hungry and she's thinking about the toilet, though. <laughs> what is second generation Stan wearing? I suppose it's okay, but it's... Doesn't look Stanley Tweedle ish. Oh my gosh, we got somebody, Victoria Huddleston, crying over the broken dollhouse. Why don't you fix it for me then? Why is Victoria Huddleston, one of Stan, Stan's exes, crying over the doll, broken dollhouse? Why don't she just fix it for me? Fix it! Quit crying over it and fix it. Just fix it for me. Fix it! Quit crying over it and fix it. Fix it. Come on, Victoria. Fix it. You're crying over the dollhouse. Why don't you just fix it? Don't be... St These people are stupid. These sins are stupid. Why don't you just fix it? She's so crying about it. Why can't you just freaking fix it? Oh, my gosh. That... And, oh, now she just... Oh, it's not, now she's just unappreciated. She's so ungrateful now. She, she didn't appreciate the effort that Briley had to come in and fix it. And Victoria, why couldn't Victoria fix it? She was right there. She had crying over it. She could have fixed it. Oh, I swear. And then when Briley comes in to fix it, Victoria's like, hmm, whatever. And leaves. Like, really, the effort. And just unappreciated. Oh, my gosh. Sucks. Is it because Victoria's childish? She's why she cried over the thaw house. It's because he's childish. Oh, I'm hideous. <laughs> if you say so. <laughs> I don't think so. But, you know, I, I don't think so. I think aliens are cool. Maybe I shouldn't have give uh, Zev, Mermaid Zev with a Z that silver bikini because it shows her butt crack. 
Maybe I should have given her that, that string bikini because I really could see her butt crack. <laughs> you can almost. <laughs> I mean, seriously. So like she's almost naked. Okay, party's over. Bye. Bye. Go home. If you don't live here. Okay, I'm about to give some makeovers to Kai and Joseph. Ah, oh, Kai, what is wrong with you? Grades are up. But they're acting stupid. Kai, especially. Why oh, is Kai, alien Kai, acting stupid? Start inviting some people over. I mean, look at me. I'm doing commentary like like two thirty in the morning because I don't have any earn time to do it because Zoe's on my computer all the time now. And I'm hard to have time to do commentary for my videos. And when I want to get on, I don't want, I just want to watch TV. <laughs> but I also got the videos. And I don't have time to do either one. Oh my gosh, the way he's walking. We get food still sitting out from yesterday. Ah, oh, not good. So I don't know. I threw it out. This cake from yesterday. Who wants to eat cake from yesterday? Who wants to eat leftovers? I've been sitting out all day outside for twenty four hours. I wouldn't. It's kind of like when something falls on the floor. I tell my kid, there's no five, such thing as a five second rule in this house. It falls on the floor, it goes in the trash. We don't eat things off the floor, there's no five second rule. That's disgusting. You don't eat stuff off the floor. I don't care if it's an M, I don't care what it is. It falls on the floor, it goes in garbage. I'm not eating it. I have a very, I have a weak stomach. Because seriously, if, I think is how dirty my floor is, and I, and no, I get no. I start to I start to gag. I kid you not. Look at Kai, alien Kai. He's a blonde, but that's okay. He looked like he's about to cut a fart in that pose. <laughs> Sorry. I can't, that's custom content accessory that he's got on his head. But it's alien custom content accessory. But that's okay. He's an alien. That, it came like that automatically when I was going into custom content. And he already had that on. And I'm like, it's okay. He can wear it because he's an alien. Like if aliens that they if they if I go because content and they can form in their alien form that's okay because they're aliens I accept that I ex accept it when they're mermaids too because they get a mermaid form you know it's fine. or when they're vampires and they have vampire form vampire form is not supposed to look like they're human form there's a, there's a whole point of disguise. My aliens don't like to disguise themselves very much, now do they? 
They walk around like, hey, look at me, I'm an alien. I've never seen any of my aliens disguise themselves. And it's going to be funny when I, um, when May grows up, because May is the eight, because I was like, it was it like her mind that was an alien? Wait a second. Um, Laika is a mermaid in May's alien. Oh, sorry, May. May's alien, when she's all grown up, and I go to cast to fix her, and as soon as I get out of cast, she, her, her alien in, in form is messed up again. It got messed up somehow. I want to exit it out of Kratos, and I'm just like, how did that even happen? You get to see. Trust me, you'll get to see that. Eventually, you will. Because I spent, I don't know how many minutes, fixing May to her alien and human form to be perfect. And then as soon as I exit out, she's messed up. I'm like, wait a second, that's n- no. Because she was a red alien. And then, as soon as I took her out of Kratos him, she was a totally different color. Like, what happened? And she was not wearing the outfits I put on her. Like, what happened? It's like, EA decided, well, I don't like this outfit. <laughs> well, I don't like your outfit. I don't like how you just think spandex and underwear go together as a... As a side wear. I don't like how sometimes you see Sims just wearing, like, a female Sim, like, wearing a bra, underwear, and spandex under the underwear, and a Darth Vader hat, and calling that a, like, casual wear. <laughs> It's not the height of fa- the latest fashion. I kid you not. <laughs> I'm like, what is that? And gloves. <laughs> what? The- Who wears that in public? This is not a convention. <laughs> okay, maybe it is. Uh, oh my gosh. <laughs> you think that's better than my outfit that I pick out? You're out of your mind. <laughs> Those who play Sims on a regular basis, you know what I'm talking about. I'm I'm thinking about this furry mod. (laughs) Imagine the gameplay, people. (laughs) Imagine the gameplay. I'm going to get out of that. Oh, boy, do I got some gameplay ideas for you. Well, some gameplay ideas for myself, but gameplay series for you. <laughs> oh, you know what I'm going to do? You know I'm like I made a vet, veterinary legs? What if it's just the legs you can just live in? And they're dogs or cats or whatever. <laughs> I can't imagine this. That'd be so much fun. I kid you not. I would put a kennel legs. You know, like, like, uh, Lex House for cat lovers and Lex House for dog lovers. Um, I really take it back. Just, it won't be a vet clinic. I already have a vet clinic. I'll have a dog house and a cat house for these furries to live in. <laughs> it's so cool. <laughs> Woo! Oh, and I'll give the the person who made the mod. I'll give them a lot of credit. I'm I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I just... Oh man, it just came up on my recommendations on YouTube. I'm like, I gotta check this out. It looks so cool. Just imagine the gameplay. 
Captain Lex's character is... I'll flip a coin. If... You know, so far, they all have cats or dogs. And different swatches for them, okay? Here's what I'm thinking. I'll flip a coin. If my, each character either wants to be a cat or a dog. And I'll randomize. But color... <laughs> Because they have color swatches, and, and ear swatches. And, oh my gosh, it's it's out of this world. I, I can't wait. To, if this ever gets available, I will use it and I will play with it. I kid you. And give this person who created the mod full credit in my videos. I kid you not. I would. I would. It depends. I, I, I have I have some ideas. If, when it becomes available, I will, I have tons of ideas right now. I will build a dog house, a cat house. Lex, they're, they're different. Maybe skip on the fairy thing altogether. Because <laughs> the fairy house is not working out so well. Uh, there's not enough fairy con enchanted. There's not enough fairy content, okay? Not enough pixie content to make a fairy house. Okay. I try. It's, it's not going very well. Anyways. We are definitely getting close to the end of this video. So stay tuned for part 102. Laika and May will age up. Risha and Reginald will be born. And, stay, and Stan will get a new girlfriend. I'm not telling you who, it's a surprise. So save him for part 102.